Hey Sitara, down here again. Uh, this is video number two, uh, and this one is going to go off of the search engine optimization for your website. And I'm going to go ahead and stick with Oklahoma City, uh, just because I've already done all the research there. Uh, so the Google algorithm goes off of three things: content, citations, and backlinks. And uh, within that content, it is a must that you have those high quality and relevant keywords that the Google user is searching for. So I know this is going to sound a little silly, but this right here is not a keyword. And so the Google algorithm cannot identify that you're doing the services that the user is searching for. OK, so it's all user based. So this would need to be changed to you have to take that in and you'd have to take the comma out. It needs to just say root repair Oklahoma City. As I've uh, already showed you, that is a uh, relevant keyword for that area. Uh, it's also really good that you guys got all your back pages built out right here. Uh, extremely beneficial because, of course, your website is not going to rank organically in Yukon or Oklahoma City unless you have those keywords in there. And it's super hard to stuff all those keywords in there just on the home page. So each of these service area pages will have to have those high quality and relevant keywords for those areas. So scrolling down, uh, it's good to get them. These are like where your headers are and your content. Uh, I don't like to put a, a keyword, I, or I do 150 words per uh, keyword in there. Uh, that way you're not overstuffing the content and getting too much in there. You will be penalized from the algorithm doing that. So another way to get your keywords in there is have your pictures saved as the correct search terms. Of course, the Google algorithm cannot see your pictures, but they can see what's behind them. So. We will want to have hell, damage, roof repair, Oklahoma City, or roof repair, OKC. You're going to have to have uh, your alt text and your images saved into your website uh, like that. So the next thing we're going to go over real quick, which we already did some of this, roof repair, Oklahoma City. This is the, this is the digital real estate of Google's uh, algorithm here. So of course, local service ads, PPC, we've already gone over that. So this is your local map pack. So the local map pack all has to do off your citations and reviews. Uh, I know you guys already know a lot about that in El Reno. You guys are already ranked in the map pack. Uh, if you'd want to get another, if you had another GMB that could get verified in Oklahoma City, that would get a way for you to get more leads and calls through that. Uh, but so citations, simply put, all it is is online directory. So it could be Yelp, uh, Easy Local, Find Us Here, MapQuest, any one of those are directories. So you, it's anywhere where your business name, address, and phone number is listed. And uh, the more citations that you get, the more ranking that you're going to get in the map pack because Google's algorithm sees you as important that you're in all these other directories and listed across the web. The next one down, this is your organic traffic. Organic traffic all has to do off of your backlinking. Backlinking is... Another website, such as a private blog network or a guest post, where it has an article that's relevant to the roofing industry, and in there, you're going to have an anchor text that's going to be a clickable link that goes back to your website. And that right there is what Google sees as authority. The more backlinks and websites, just like your citations, the more you're, you're listed in, the more authority that they're going to give you. So this is a, another tool that I use called Arefs. Kind of similar to the SpyFu one, but SpyFu is geared towards Google Ads. Arifs is geared towards SEO. So you can see that your site is fairly new or just you guys haven't done a whole lot of SEO work to it other than adding content, but content alone is not enough. Uh, but you can see that uh, your URL rating, domain rating, barely existent. Uh, you've got eight referring domains going back to 11 backlinks. You're getting picked up for 20 organic keywords. And you've only got about one person visiting your website every month. Uh, scrolling down here, these are the anchor texts that I uh, was talking about. So uh, it's really good to have anchor text as keywords. So you want to have your article uh, relevant to roofing, roof repair OKC or roof repair Oklahoma City. That's a clickable link that goes back to your website. And that roof repair Oklahoma City keyword will be your anchor text. It gives you just kind of a double authority because the Google algorithm is identifying that not only are you uh, have a backlink of an anchor, then that anchor text for that keyword, it's going to your site where more of those search terms and high quality keywords are getting picked up. So 
We're going to dive in here real quick and just see what keywords the algorithm is picking up on your website. So it looks like you got, you're getting picked up for roof repair, Nichols Hills. Almost getting some traffic there, not quite, but you guys are on position nine. So that one's really good. If we ran some backlinks to that, we could push that up. It's got a super low KD, so this is keyword difficulty. This is just how hard it is to rank for that keyword. And then your volume is your just, it's a metric that Google uses uh, to track the monthly search volume that the users are searching for this specific keyword. Uh, but other than that, I didn't see any other keywords in here that you guys are getting any traffic for. Um, so we're going to dive over here and look at one of your competitors here in uh, OKC, or I know they have a, their, their office is in Yukon, I believe. Uh, but these guys, they've done an extraordinary amount of work, SEO work to their website. So you can see their URL rating and domain rating are up there. They're getting, they got 190 referring domains going back to almost 3,000 backlinks, right? So let's look into their organic keywords. So here's a good one, commercial roofing, OKC. It gets a 60 search volume and it only, it's got a super low KD. They're getting six people visiting their website every month to that. Uh, roof repair, OKC, 150 organic searches. This KD right here is actually in the medium level. It would take about nine months to rank for a, for a KD like this, but they've got another five people visiting their website every month for that. What's another one? We did commercial roofing Oklahoma City. I don't think we did that. We didn't. So 60 uh, KDs, a little bit higher there, but they've got another seven people visiting their website every month for that. So those three keywords alone could be a game changer for you guys to have that extra 15 people traveling to your website every month looking for roofing repair or, uh, you know, commercial roofing in Oklahoma City. So the next thing and the last thing that we're going to go over real quick is the backlink. So this is the one of the main reasons why I love using Aero so much is because we like to use the copycat method. And basically what we're doing with that is we go in, we find all the backlinks that your competitor is using and we get their backlinks as well. Because again, just like with the Google ads, using their ad copy and their uh, ad relevance, it, uh, if it's working for them, it will work for us too. So let me pause the video and I'll get this loaded up into their backlinks. Okay, so here we are looking at Salazar's backlinks. Uh, again, using the copycat method, we're going to uh, go in and get what they have because if it works for them, it works for you. Uh, so it looks like they've got some stuff going down in San Antonio, and I normally don't find stuff this quick, but you can see how this one has a domain rating of 83, URL rating of 16, so pretty high authority site right here. And you can also see here that there's about 305 people visiting this website every month. So uh, that's got some good traffic to it and that's really high authority in Google's eyes. So uh, it, it's important that you just can't go out and just get any backlink if it's got low DR, low UR, they're pointless, but you want these high uh, ones. So these are actually, uh, this is where it's at. Um, and these are actually pretty popular in the pest control industry as well. It just gives, uh, you know, the independent roofing contractors near San Antonio. So this is kind of a directory, but it's used as a backlink as well because their website is listed. And uh, so they're listed in here somewhere, and that's what's giving them the authority and getting them ranked in the top of the search engine. So again, I hope you guys found value in this video. Um, you're free to use these tips and tricks yourselves. If you're interested in, in learning more and, and running some more backlinks and updating your keywords, let me know uh, if you guys want to get started.